This is my unboxing video for the Legend of Zelda The Skyward Sword Collector's Edition for the Nintendo Wii. A very, very good deal because it's only 69 bucks, and that would be the same if you wanted to buy the Wii Motion Plus, plus the normal version of the game. And you get a really awesome bar, um, box art, <laughs> bark art, and you also get a very nice and colorful gold Wii Motion Plus. Gold is nice. Then we open the box and what do we find? We find that there is a game in there. It's really really nice and gold and shiny and everything. And then inside the box there's some manuals. There's my GameStop receipt. There is the manual for the Wii Motion Plus. But you don't really need that that much. If you want to use it, you can use it. It's okay. Whoever needs to know how to set up Wii Motion Plus. Then we get more of the box. And... Some free batteries! Yay, free batteries! By the way, not the cheap kind. Those Maxwell batteries are really good. They last a long time. If you're asking my Wii Remote, since I got it the second day it was out. Not the first day, because if I would come the first day, the GameStop people said they were all out of these type of copies. I had to get the crappy normal version. Well, it's not crappy. It's all good, but this one's better. There's the Wii Motion Plus with the jacket, and there is where you can put your nunchuck. I was scared that you wouldn't be able to put nunchuck in the Wii Motion Plus. So I never had one. It comes with a really nice jacket, very flexible, plasticky. But everything's made of gold, and that's the point, and that's the main part. And there's the Hylian logo on it. Hylian, Hylian, whatever way suits your purpose, and... It's really, really nice, and it's sort of a matte finish instead of the smooth, glossy finish of normal Wii remotes. And it has a very nice feel to it. There's the box with all of its nice writing, The Birth of a Legend, with Link riding his loft wing. That's probably really fun. Well, it's not probably really fun. It is really fun. But I wish I could ride a loft wing in real life, too. <laughs> but it's not at all like the, like the sailing from the from Wind Waker. It's not like slow and annoying. It's really fast paced and I you really like and even go through these little like speed portals to make it faster if you're if you're really like that annoyed or something, but you really shouldn't be. And there's the actual unboxing of it. I'm opening the plastic as you can see. It's a really nice box, a really nice cover art. I recommend whoever's doing an unboxing video to unbox the actual cardboard box first before the video so you're not fumbling with it or whatever. Or if you're unboxing, don't unbox it with a pen like I used to. And well, it gets messy. Just don't. <laughs> Let's put it at that. There was still some plastic on it, oddly enough, when I was like about to play it, and I found some plastic on it by that time. There's a really nice music CD. I liked it. It feels really nice, like a little bit matte finish also on music CD, if that's possible. I didn't even know that was possible. It's pretty cool. And there's a bunch of Nintendo advertisements, which were junky. Well, not junky, I guess, but I don't really care for them. And, yeah. There is a really cool little book with all the songs that gives you a little bit of history. It's not a history book like Super Mario All Stars Wii, and there's because that was really nice. But you can get like you can get a guide to this. They'll basically have all concept art and different other things, which I think I didn't know of, but that was pretty cool. But once I heard about it, I thought I might get it because that was like the art book for the Super Mario Bros. Wii version for this. 
has a really nice car for awesome manual. I like when people put time into manuals. Even though most people don't read them, I used to read manuals like all the time just to look at the color art and different nice things when I was little. So it kinda disappointed me when like all oh, this Call of Duty manuals have like three pages or some like total bowl like that. So I think that's that's not nice. You should treat a manual it's very good. Have a good manual. And the game is really good and the game looks really awesome. And that's